Hello friends, welcome once again to Sagas Online Mass. In this video, I'm going to provide a solution to this particular problem having here before us. Please, if today is your first time viewing, kindly click up the follow button so that you can upload them an exciting video you will notice And also subscribe to my YouTube channel where you can enjoy most of my masked video. Let's consider let's consider this question on the board. We are giving a limit of a function. We are doing that the limit of s minus 9 divided by 1 root s minus 3. Where s tends to what 9 or s approaching what 9. You know, I've seen a lot of students that make a serious mistakes in this. Because when you are seeing that s tends to 9, you can just run and go and put your 9. You will fail. Let me just let me let me show you how they do it. Imagine that s tends to 9. You now put 9 minus 9 out of our square root of 9 minus 3. And now minus 9 is what? Is 0. Divided by root 9, root 3, root 9 is what? 3 minus 3, which is what? 0 divided by 0. And this is undefined. This is on what? This is undefined. Let me show you how to solve this when you come across. I will show you two methods or something. Two methods. Let me show you. When you have this, what you do, you multiply both the numerator and the denominator by the conjugate of the denominator. So if I multiply this by root 3, root s plus 3, root, if, if here is minus the conjugate will be all plus, all over what root what x plus what 3. Now this is sentence as into x minus 9 close into what root x plus what 3 close, all over what into root, onto root 3 minus 3 close into what root x plus what 3 close. Now, I will expand this. Let me expand the denominator. So I'm going to have that uh, root s into root s plus 3 minus 3 into root x plus what 3. Now, root s times root s is just s. Root s times 3 is just plus 3 root s minus 3. Minus 3 times root s is minus 3 root x. And minus 3 times minus 3 is what? Minus 9. We agree with that. 3 root s minus 3 root s is gone, so I'm left at x minus what 9. So all the denominator is just s minus 9. So I can remove this, and now I know that all the denominator is s minus this. So I'm going to have that into x minus 9 close into root x plus 3 all over what x minus what 9. You can already factorize this. So you can see that this will cancel out what this. You can see it. So I'm left at the limit, the limit into root x plus what 3 where s tends to what 9 from here i can comfortably substitute the value of s can see so this is now root 9 plus what 3 and root 9 is what 3 so 3 plus 3 is equals to what 6 let's to see that the limit of this is equals to what 6 this is the, this is the one one method of solving it you see you can see how simple it is so when you are giving something like don't rush Put down and what? When you see something like this, because you know, you just cannot give you undefined value, you must give you a value. So, so this is the value which is 6, and this is the clear solution to one of these solutions, so this problem. So, I want to use another method to solve it, which is very interesting. Now, let me use another method to solve it. Sorry that I'm using my bare hand, I forgot my duster. Okay, let's use another method. I can say that let let u equals to the denominator, which is x minus 9. Now, we differentiate u with respect to x. That is to say that the u over the s is equal to what? 1. Will you agree with me? Because if I differentiate a constant, is 0. If I differentiate x, is just 1. Now, I'm now saying that let v and v equals to what? Root x minus 3. Now, I will now differentiate. Now, I will now say the v over the x is equal to. If I differentiate 3, is 0. So, this is then s to the power of what? 1 over 2 by one of the law of indices. Now I want to differentiate this, so this will be dy, the v over the s, which is equal to, now this is 1 over 2, v s to the power of 1 negative what, 81 over what, 2. Now I want to simplify this further so that dy, the v over the s will be equal to 1 over 2 multiplied by 1 over the square root of what, x. And the v over the s will be equal to 1 over 2 multiplied by the square root of what, x. Can see? So now uh, let me when this when s tends to what nine. So look at the x. Look at here. I can put that the v over the s is equals to one over the square root of v what nine. Because anyway, I see s, I will put my nine where nine s tends to what nine. So square root of nine is what this implies that this will give you what one over two multiplied by what three, which is equals to what one over what six. 
Now I'm going to do that the V over the X. Can you see that the V over the X is equals to 1 over 6, comma the U over the X is equals to what 1. Now this will not be uh, the V the V sorry the U over the X divided by what the V over the X. Now I will multiply um, both the numerator by the I multiply both the numerator and the denominator by the by the reciprocal of uh, the v over the x. So we multiply here by the v the x over what the v. I multiply here by the x over what the v. This will cancel out this and this will cancel out this. So I'm left with uh, I'm left with uh, the u over what the x is multiplied by the x over what the v. Now let me remove this. Now look at what we have. So what is our the u over the x? Look at the u over the x. Our the u over the x is one. You can see the u over the x is one. Multiply by what is the s dv? Look at this. The, look at the s dv. If the v over the s is one over two, that means the s dv will be a six. Do you understand what I'm saying? If the v over the s is one over six, that means the, the s dv will go to six all over one. You understand? So this is what the uh, I will not take the reciprocal of it. Look at this, it's the reciprocal. The, v, the S, the V, look at, but we're having the V, the X. So this was 6 over 1. You understand what I'm doing? So that 1 times this will just give you 6 over what 1. And 6 divided by 1 is 6, 6. So you can see how simple it is. I've used two methods to solve this and it's giving me exactly the 6. And this is just the clear solution to this particular problem. Thank you for watching this video. Please do well and share it with your friends. Thank you and God bless you. Bye bye.